everybody. Today we're going to go over the Michael Jackson tune, Wanna Be Starting Something. All right, let's break this thing down bit by bit. Um, first off, with the hands, actually this entire pattern is all based off of uh, 16th notes and just different placements of them. Um, so with the hands, um, if we started with just a basic 16th note pattern, we would just go... Nothing to it. Um, for half of the pattern, uh, the right hand is removed, and then when the right hand is brought back in on the hi-hat, um, dynamically they're bringing all of those strokes up. So you've got... Then we're just bringing the right hand over to the snare. So we got... pocket of this has got to be there. Um, and you kind of want to be thinking um, like Billy Jean um, to go to another Michael Jackson tune. You, you want to be going. Reason being, if you lose the pocket, it has no point. This is a dance tune and you've got to get the dance floor moving. And what they've done is such an amazing job of taking these complex things and all the parts of the drums and still making it funky. Um, so don't let me catch you playing this song out and not making it funky, or I will take you down to Funky Town. So the kick pattern is this. I'm going to slow it down again, a bit. One, two, three, four. Start this thing real slow until you get all the notes feeling, feeling funky. Then it's just all about having fun with it, separating out the hands, and practicing it over and over and over again. This is such a great exercise to build up uh, fit, foot dexterity, get really good control, and make sure that everything's feeling good um, and you're getting some heads nodding. Got it.